Welcome back. It's been a couple days since the last episode and not much has changed except this shit haircut. I tried to cut it in lockdown and yeah, it just yeah, didn't work. Other than that, I've had a cough and stuff, so this is why I haven't really updated it in the last couple of days, but we're going to get back at it today. So things have been going well since we last spoke and I'm just going to get straight into the stats starting with analytics. Now I did say before we had a big Google update and it absolutely crushed my soul and absolutely killed me but it's come back stronger than ever guys. It's come back stronger than ever and as we can see over here we had about 721 users uh, on the 14th of January then we've got a thousand. That was from a reddit post I did. I gave away something for free and had a landing page where people would sign up with an email. Then uh, going on to the 16th we go back down to about 800 then 795 then 800 again then 746 and we're back down to 671 today. Now I have checked the rankings in my SERP robot and the Google search console and I have claimed a lot of positions for top terms now and you know when I was saying in the last episodes where it was bouncing between like five and one and then three and one I'm now like firmly in number one for quite a few positions that bring in a bit of revenue which is blessed so things have been going well on that front on the main affiliate we've made a couple more sales we're getting a few steady more sales as you can see there were two days where i didn't have sales but we're getting a steady number of sales a day now it's about one sale a day it's not as good as it was before i don't really know why that is i did have an article ranking for a christmas term so maybe the traffic's just started to drop off around the this time in january but as you can see it's still going steady we're still making a bit from it and yeah it's it's going better than it was so we can't complain moving over to the next one we've had about three sales this week all equating to 10 pound each i don't really know how much we've made over the month but we've made a fair bit over the month and i just got paid out my commissions over the last couple of days now fiverr's gone a bit crazy since i last spoke to you we had about two more commissions come through one of them was like three quid somewhere down here yeah one pound fifty down here and then Today, you can't really see it because this little thing is fucking annoying. I don't know how to get it out of the way. But over here, we've had like a commission of about 20 something, uh, $28 as you can see there. So Fiverr's coming in strong. We've got a good number of registrations coming in per week, about a registration every other day. So whatever they deposit in the future, I make 10% on and we've got a 40% conversion rate on the amount of clicks that we're getting. So that is pretty insane for an affiliate marketing business. Over on this affiliate, we haven't seen any more sales come through, but we've had some actions happen. So people have been signing up through the link and signing up for the free version of it. So hopefully they will convert at a later date. Who knows if they will, will or they won't, but this isn't an affiliate I'm really that bothered about. I don't really promote them that much. So an extra bit of change coming from them is nice anyway. Then if we move over to Rakuten, we have seen incredible amounts of commission since we last spoke guys like this has gone mad over the last few days and as you can see when I last spoke to you I think I had about a $15 commission there or a $14 commission there and we had about $1 commissions coming sporadically through every now and then but since then I've ranked for two terms where I'm promoting this particular affiliate and boy it's just gone crazy so as you can see we made 14 then we made 30 then we made 16 then we made 30 then we made 28 and it just keeps going moving over to the next affiliate we haven't made any sales since i last spoke to you we've had 65 signups um not 650 dollars in earnings so we've had about one sign up or two no, we've had two signups since I've started making these videos. Nothing to really report here. It's a bad analytics system. So it just tells you up here when you make a new sale and that's it. It doesn't tell you when. And then over to display ads. As you can see, we've been making a bit more a day. So we were around the $2 mark before when we hit when we were hit by the Google update. And now we're going back to about the $3 a day mark. We went back down to just under $3 on Wednesday, which was yesterday. That was the 670 traffic day. So I'm hoping to shoot back up and make a bit more. Other than that, things have been going pretty well, despite me being kind of ill and losing all my hair. Instagram's been going pretty well as well, and I've been smashing out the TikToks. I got 28,000 views on one of my TikToks, and it just went wild. 
And then I uploaded a TikTok about how fucking bananas are delicious and healthy and it got like 2k views. So it seems pretty easy to get viral on TikTok. So I'm gonna go all in on TikTok and Instagram reels. I'm posting about three times a day on both platforms. I've seen about a growth of 100 followers on Instagram since we last spoke and that's from posting anywhere between three to six times a day, staying consistent on my story and doing follow unfollow as well. And I also purchased some shout outs for $25 which got me about 30 of those followers. So. It was worth the $25, but if you wanna grow followers fast, it's quite a lot of money to pay for shout outs from my experience. I also got banned on one of my Instagram accounts because I did too many follows and unfollows basically. So <laughs> that was fun and I'm banned till for the next three days. Other than that, today I've got to write a new 4,000 word article. So that's pretty much what I'm focused on for today. I've got to make this video as well. And I want to try and start a new video of a kind of walkthrough process of how to do something for my other niche. So today's going to be pretty busy and I woke up late as well. So I don't know whether I'm going to get it all done, but we'll see. We'll see. Anyway, guys, that's my entry for today. Thank you so much for watching. If anybody does watch these, please hit the like, comment below, ask me questions. I am here to help you for free. I want to help you start earning money online. Also, stay tuned for some different kind of videos I'm going to be bringing out over the next kind of month. I've got some awesome things planned. I'm going to be doing cryptocurrency trading because I got some cryptocurrency for free. And I'm also going to be doing stuff on Facebook Marketplace and other places like Gumtree and stuff to show you guys just how easy it is to actually sell things on there and make a profit. Anyway, that's it. I will see you guys in the next one. The next one, the next one.